it's Todd with Single Plane Academy. So let's talk about the role that clubs play in the single plane swing and why you need to be single plane fit for equipment. Now, one of the most important things that happens with people is they bring to us clubs that don't fit them well. And if clubs don't fit you well, you make swing compensations for poor lie angles, poor shaft length, and wrong shafts, and maybe too heavy. There's a lot of reasons that clubs can be improperly fit to you. One of the most important things you can do is a question I get asked often is, hey Todd, how important are the clubs that fit you? If you have really good fitting clubs that fit your single plane swing, then it enhances your ability to swing on a single plane. So we like to reverse engineer the fitting process and get you properly fit to perfect single plane fitting clubs to your body size. So what's important is that the clubs fit the proper length and the lie angle based on your height and your size, based on your arm length. So the first thing we wanna do is make sure the club's single plane fit the length and the lie angle. The next thing we wanna make sure is the grip size, based on your hand size, we get the proper grip size in your hands so you can get the grip and the orientation of the face correct with the hands. And of course, we wanna get the shaft, the correct shaft, because based on your swing speed, we wanna maximize your ability to hit the ball long distances and control the spin of the golf ball. So we call it the reverse engineering or single plane fitting process because this is gonna enhance your ability to improve your swing as opposed to fighting equipment that doesn't fit you and making swing compensations for improperly fit golf clubs. Hey, you wanna learn more about the single plane swing? Come join me at our community at singleplaneacademy.com.